We have uh, a centralized police force, about the largest in the world. It has uh, a population of 325,000. So basically, their orientation to their work was what we call regime policing, doing whatever the government in power tells you to do. And that is also the context in which our work is done, to try to move them away from this regime policing philosophy to democratic policing. The approach of mainstream human rights groups in Nigeria has been accusatory, you know, point out the problem areas, issue reports about them which are widely carried in the media, or go to court. We came in offering partnership. We came in offering empathy. We came in not with a view to exposing them, but working with them to find common solutions and also ensuring that community priorities are infused in the police priority areas. We want them to be true professionals, respected in the communities that they work in, adequately rewarded for the dangerous work that they do. And that is the strategy that has helped us you know, in this work. Even though we operate in, in you know, remote part of the world, uh, in terms when you're looking at uh, the world map, the issues that we're dealing with and the concerns we have on a daily basis are pretty much the same.